today we're at Mitchell Elementary. We have some hand sewing, a lot of these old connector kits like Lincoln Logs and Connects and fashion hacking, computer programming, and some circuitry work. Michigan makers work with kids to develop projects out of their own imagination and creativity. It's like a stereo a little. Like we can like change the sound. The maker movement is built on a couple of ideas. One is that what used to be the space that only corporations and companies and factories could own, like 3D printers, now we can have some of that stuff on our kitchen counter. But making can also be about self-soothing, of discovering who we are, and exploring the world and where we fit within it. Who wants to make a card? Because you're making a pillow, right? Okay. Yeah. Okay. One, two, three, two, three, two. Lots of our graduate students go on to become librarians or to work in community organizations where doing this kind of work is emerging as a new model. I knew I wanted to participate in Michigan Makers as soon as I heard about it. I knew I wanted to work with kids. I knew that this would have a lot to do with my degree. Maker spaces are very much uh, a part of a lot of school library programs these days. You're getting a lot of programming experience that's something they're looking for a lot in the job search process. Our kids are so enthusiastic about everything that we do that it's really, it's exciting to be with them. I like to show my creativity and do, make stuff and have fun. It was fun deciding what you wanted to be able to just make. You can like share your creations with other people, like share some things that are in your mind.